Do you know why Diwali is celebrated on the darkest night of the year? It's time you knew the true story behind the Festival of Lights. It all starts with the Ramayan, one of the greatest spiritual epics of all time. While the story has many layers of meaning, at its core, it represents every person's struggle to know themselves. To put it simply, the message of Ramayan will help you to understand how to live a better life. So how does it do that? Diwali is a story of a battle between Lord Ram and Ravan. But this isn't just a battle that happened thousands of years ago. This battle is happening right now inside each and every one of us. It starts with Lord Ram, who represents our higher self, our divine soul, the infinite life force that lives inside everyone and in all places. Our soul, Ram, lives in Ayodhya, the place of no conflict. It means our soul lives in peace. It isn't concerned with trivial things like how do I look today? What do others think of me? How much money do I have? What's my relationship status or what's my next career move? But in the story, everything changes upon Ram's marriage to Sita, which represents the union between our soul and the human body. As soon as that happens, they are banished from Ayodhya. And in our own lives, whenever we focus our thoughts on the body rather than our soul, then we too lose our peace and we're banished into the jungle of the world. Even in the jungle, Sita continues to meditate on Ram. But one day, Sita sees a golden deer and gets totally enamored by it, just like our eyes and senses are always distracted by worldly things. And when she stops meditating on Ram and goes after the deer, then she's trapped by a demon called Ravan, who represents our ego. And he's depicted as having 10 faces and 20 arms, which means that our ego is not so easy to identify. And it often comes in disguises in many different forms. So the battle begins between Ram and Ravan, and eventually Ram is victorious. He manages to defeat Ravan and bring his soulmate Sita back home. The spiritual master Guru Nanak summarizes this real human struggle between our ego and our divine light. He says, Ghat Ghat Rav Rahya Alak Apare Ram. In each and every heart is this unseen and infinite Ram. Alak Apar Apar Sacha Aap Mar Milaye. When we kill our egos, only then will we unite with this invisible and infinite truth. So, why do we really celebrate Diwali on the darkest night of the year? It's so that we can remind ourselves to break free from our own dark habits, our worldly obsessions, egos, self-importance, insecurities, and all our inner demons. This year, as well as lighting candles and fireworks, let's learn and share the deeper meaning of this celebration. Make this Diwali a challenge for us